The one-day elective congress was attended by 383 delegates from various branches around the country. In his acceptance speech, he called on the party members and supporters to embrace unity. The newly elected president said he will revive and revamp all party branches to ensure that it's a force to be reckoned with come 2014 elections. The former Dowers constituency councillor vowed to win back the constituency which the party had governed since 1992. He lost control of the constituency when he lost to the Swapo party candidate during the 2010 regional and local authorities elections. This has been put squarely on my shoulders during this campaign and I took it as a challenge and it will be dealt with by my office to see to it that Dowers constituency will get a suitable candidate and to bring back Dowers where it belongs. That will be my the newly elected UDF president also announced the party's intention to host an election and policy conference in January next year. Part of the conference will include policy formulation and analysis of the party's progress and activities since its inception. We are challenged as leaders of UDF party to formulate such policies that will reflect our commitment to serve all our people with pride and to meet their basic development needs. He further called on the Congress to reserve the positions of the Secretary for Local Government, Education, Rural Development and Election Secretariats as they will be appointed by his office. 